Good morning. We're vlogging today. We're doing it. We are doing it. It is currently 10.45. I'm all showered. I'm ready to beat this face. We're starting off the day by getting breakfast at Hatch. I've never been there before, but it's supposedly this delicious breakfast place. I'm excited. Jordan is telling me that they have this pancake that has cinnamon butter that comes with it. So, yes, I woke up this morning and I was like, oh, it's a healthy day. Because I ate like trash. Yesterday was a Sunday. I ate so bad. I'm like, time to start the day off right and have a nice apple. I'm going to have a salad for lunch. Like, I'm going to do good. But no, I'm gonna have a pancake instead. I'm excited to vlog. It's been a minute since I've done this. I wanna take you guys along. All right, guys, so we hit 3,000 subscribers. I can't even believe this. This is crazy. I literally hit 2,000 last Monday, and on Sunday, I hit 3,000. Like, what? So what I want you guys to do right now is comment down below where you're from because I wanna know where my new subscribers are from, and I wanna know what's up, and I wanna get to know everybody. Also, do you guys like when I go live on YouTube or Instagram? better. I kind of like YouTube lives because I don't feel weird leaving them up. Guys, last night, Paul slept over. He actually just left. He hasn't been feeling good, so he wanted to take NyQuil before he went to sleep. NyQuil and DayQuil are in the same box. He took DayQuil before going to sleep, so he had the worst sleep of his life. He always has the worst sleep, but anybody else feel that way? Like, they just can't get comfortable? Like, do you guys toss and turn at night, or do you sleep good? Because I personally sleep really good, and Paul sleeps like trash. He literally wakes up every hour. He's always tossing and turning. He wakes up in the morning with like pillows at his feet, a blanket over his head. Like he is a mess in his sleep. So I just started using the Jeffree Star Cosmetics Concealer. I've been getting asked about this a lot lately because it is fucking stunning. It just brightens up that under eye. And I was never one for the bright under eye. I always like to just look tan. I didn't care about highlighting and shit like that. But honey, will I tell you that I will never go back. Oh my God looked up and I looked like a psycho man. All right, I'll be back in two seconds when I have a full face. I'm back. This is the fit for today. I'll show you my shoes in a moment. Okay, here is the full fit. Nothing crazy, nothing crazy. If you guys watched my birthday vlog, you know that these socks are for a seven foot tall man. Basically what I did was just put them half on and then I took the excess sock and folded it over. So we are making it work. Okay, hi guys, I'm back. So we are to Jordan's house and I'm so hungry. Turn right onto <laughs> <Okay. laughs> that out. In a quarter if mile, turn left onto <laughs> She's gonna interrupt us now, isn't she? Okay. Should we jam? What should we do? I think like, we uh, should. Should we give you a jam sash? Should I we think it's thumbnail? Time. Yeah. I need to move back. Hurry. <laughs> okay. We look ridiculous right now. <laughs> anyway, we got a 30 minute ride to Jordan's house, so that calls for a jam sash. Doesn't it now? Thank God I have tints. I wouldn't want anyone to see this going on. <laughs> Molly needs to be here for this song, but it needs to be done. It just, it just had, I just had to do it. I had to do it. I know my hair is frizzy. It's not done yet. Yeah, yeah, it's all a part of the process. I pull up to my town with a prize on my hand. This song makes me drive fast. It's dangerous. It just makes me want to go crazy. Here we go. Best song ever. Why is he on my ass? about themselves and this is gonna turn into a rant that's really what it is like somebody literally okay so I'm in the middle lane right let's just explain it I'm, I'm in the middle lane and somebody decided to just go from the far left all the way to the right with probably without even looking and almost scratching the front of my car but they yeah. didn't care why would they care they only care about themselves moral of the story will be our base see Love you when Jordy's here peace out we're not peacing oh, out I'm not we're, just... we're not peacing out we're going to Jordan's house bye 
Okay, so we're back with Jordan. Hi guys. And now we're going to hatch. I'm so excited. Um, Jordan went through it this morning. Oh. She went through it. I went through it. Actually, <laughs> my car went through it. A car went through my car, so I went through it. <laughs> yeah, she got into a little fender bender today, but it wasn't her fault. I know everybody says that, but I was literally driving straight and no. someone came out of a spot. Yeah. And yeah, so Jordan got in a little fender bender and then ended up having to call the police. I literally <laughs> had to call 911. Today. Like, What's your emergency? Yeah, like, that's <laughs> oh my god, so no, it's a fender bender. <laughs> this is how I get to India's. Wow. Oh, what? she asked me where I got my eyelashes done. Wait, who? Yeah. The girl I got into Shut a car. The Shut your mouth. She was like, not that, telling you. Is that Winky something on Insta? I was like, no, her name's India. But this was like at the end, and then she was telling me about her daughter. Like, we went through it together. Okay, okay. And so then you guys made amends towards the end. Yes, yeah, because she wanted lashes. Okay. That's Back so to cool. everybody only caring about themselves. Yeah. Can we talk about the most underappreciated place in New York? Short. No, 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 no. <laughs> no way. You just. You I was said looking at it. I was looking at it, and once she was done saying that, I was going to say what the dairy barn is so unappreciated. Appreciated because it's literally a drive through 7 Eleven. You just drive through it. Because it was, it's like you're driving up to like a sliding door, but like a yeah. full it's size. It's so weird. I love it. It's so weird. I Wait, did they? I was just gonna say that. Do you guys have Dairy Barn near you? Comment down below. Dairy Barn. Have you ever walked through the Dairy Barn drive through? No. I oh, haven't. that's an experience. I haven't. I haven't. Because you feel like you're just walking up to a door and they're yeah. just giving like it's yeah yeah it's not the little sliding window it's like the full effect of the door like it's weird yeah, yeah. it's a really big experience it's, like closet. it's really exhilarating it's a pantry it's literally exactly our question of the day is dairy barn in any other area besides Long Island. Do we got some dairy barn in Connecticut, Virginia? Like, yeah. What's the deal? No, they're normal people and have Wawa. Oh my oh god. Oh my god, I'm so jealous. We're See, that like... is something that we are really lacking. Oh in wait, Long no, Island. but that's like 7 Eleven. No, that's... the fact of the matter is, is that Wawa has everything. Like Wawa is a whole ass snack. 7 Eleven is like a the bagels like at a Wawa. Fish. Could body man, I would <laughs> literally thank the bagel if it bodied me. I've never had a I just heard her claim. Jordan, it's so oh my God, good. It's so good. Everything they have is good. Even their sandwiches are good. Really? Yeah, like they can make a <clears throat> So the area itself of like the 7-Eleven yeah. portion of it, I see, is like normal and like they have a few like extra things like they have the for reals, yes, the for real yes. machine. When you go to the cafe area, you go up to a little like iPad and you type in what you want. You can get like, some crazy ass coffees. Like I got vanilla hazelnut cappuccino iced coffee. I used to get it that. It was so good. I couldn't even, and they're ice. Oh, oh they're ice. God. It's okay, so the camera just shut off for God knows what reason, but you can go up to that literally order any type of food that you want You could have breakfast. You could have a lunch. You could have dinner and it's good food like I swear it's and it takes fabulous. five minutes All right, we'll see you guys at Hatch. Peace. Thanks for coming to our TED talk I'm slightly on my way to the food coma. That was so good. I suggest everybody tries it out. We really need a food Instagram. We eat so good around here. Forget it. All right, guys. That is it for our adventure of eating. But we are going to go into the next adventure of taking pictures here. I think I already tapped out of that. So we didn't exactly think this through because we said we'll just take more pictures when we're done eating. But now, look at the table. It's a mess. We literally ruined the scenery. So now they're in the good light. <laughs> Literally just picked a booth in the middle of the restaurant and went for it. They're killing it. Look at this bathroom. Are you kidding? So we should take a thumbnail. Guys, this bathroom is sick. We look ridiculous. We're filming and taking Instagram pictures of ourselves. Okay, 
Okay, so <laughs> at our next location, Jordan might be making a big purchase. Yeah. Just kidding. She really wants a puppy and I honestly really want that for her, but we don't buy puppies from puppy stores. We rescue them. So uh, it's not dog, happening. Don't shout uh, out If that didn't give away what we're doing right now, we're gonna go pet dogs at a pet store. I just can't wait to kiss them. See you there. Oh, oh my God. Oh my oh. God. Get out. Hi. You guys are so cute. Let's go to another one after. Let's go. And here is where I fell in love. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. I need you, I need you, I need you. Pretty hold this, I'm putting it up. I'm literally really gonna steal this one. This is my dream dog. Stop. God. <laughs> it's so cool. Yeah, my credit card. Shut up. This one. Brooke, sh stop it. Stop it. Take a picture of its face. I don't, have to be in it. I don't even have to be in it. If we're gonna take you home, you need to learn to take photos. <laughs> Jordan goes, I love when they're a little ugly. <laughs> oh my god. How do you feel? Not good. You're kidding. You have to be kidding. You have to be kidding. You're perfect. This is insane. Okay, so we successfully left the pet store with no dog. I'm proud of you, Jordan. So on to the next puppy store to torture ourselves even more. Okay, we're switching it up. Where is she taking us? Wait, what is in there? Wait, what is that? Uh, it's also bad in here. Oh, I it just have babies. Oh my god, these are rats? <gasps> they eat their babies, they eat their babies. It's eating it, it's, I gotta go, I gotta go. I gotta go. <laughs> my, all my insides are cringing, all my insides are cringing. Here we go. I found the one. The yellow one. Oh my god. Wait, and I like this one too. Look at their blue. I'm yeah. I'm so surprised you picked out the $60 fish. <laughs> I didn't realize. Okay, you're not getting that one. No, it's 90. Okay, never mind. You're cute, but not that cute. Oh my god, I'm gonna be sick. No, I love you. I'll buy you if you really want. Whoa, your face is cute. I need to buy it. Jordan, what's wrong? It's giving hugs. I would just do this to your ears all day. You're perfect. I need you. Yep, you're what I need. I'm gonna throw up. Oh no. <laughs> Hi, Fluffs. Guys, 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 this dog is gorgeous. Oh my god, guys, this is my dream dog. This is my dream dog. Pomskis are my dream dog. I'm so surprised I'm not crying dog. right now. One eye is brown and one eye is green. Guys, I'm gonna throw up right now. I'm not kidding. This is way too much for me to handle. I need to pick it up. I need to pick it up. My life goal is to have a Pomski, and there's one in front of me with two different color eyes. What do I do about this? You can't buy him. No. Just your love. My chargers have butts. What do you mean butts? butts. The butts. <laughs> the cute? The butt, yeah. All right, guys, so we're back at Jordan's house. We are, indeed, going to Swell Taco tonight. So you will see me feasting on a Crunch and Munch. I might try one tonight. Oh my God, can you please? Wait. So we're waiting on Paul to get here, and then we're gonna take some cool pictures for Corrupted Closets website, like the header of the website almost. So we're gonna go to the village of this area. We're just gonna hang out here until Paul meets us here, and then we will be on our way to take pictures. <laughs> I'm recording! <laughs> okay guys, as you can tell from that last clip, we added another member to the yeah. gang. Hey guys, we just entered the village. Paul has to get his creative juices flowing. Okay, so we're trying to find the perfect picture location. The sun is not on our side today, so we take forever to do anything. A quick little photo in the main street. Okay, sounds like a train's about to hit them. Currently on an air conditioner. It's what we do for the shop people. All right. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna switch it up a tad. I'm gonna dip it in here and then give it a dip. In I didn't know that was allowed. Mm, it's not allowed. But we have the vegans here. Oh. They can have guac. So get crazy tonight. Anyone vegan here? No, no ma'am. Just no. allergic, allergic to cheese because they always put cheese on it. But I thought we were to. 
her first ever bite into a lemon. Thoughts on your first crunch in months? My boyfriend is not like one of my favorite things. Are you kidding? She's doing her taco dance. Oh! When our food comes, like, even if there's no music, it's just like you're eating and it's your first few bites and you're like, oh, let's go. But yeah, when you're eating and your food's really vibing with you, you, you get that little oomph in your body and you're, it just fuels your body to dance, you know? I don't do that a lot. No, I don't do it because I want to. I do it because I have to. It's an ankle. It's not age. You'll get there one day, don't worry. Guys, we eat all of them already, but I completely blacked out when I saw these churros and just started destroying them, so I didn't get a little cute montage of it, but this is heaven. This is one of the best churros I've ever had in my life, besides Disneyland. I'm trying to be civil, and you're doing nothing but being mean. You just brought up the fact that fall's coming, and you think it's I'm not, not gonna get that. Fall is here. Fall is here. It's not summer. It's fall. Double F. Fall.